wrongly. Things I never thought I'd say on a video. Ding, 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 ding. Top answer. Hooray. <laughs> Fucking hell. Weird. Life is so fun. I got smart water, guys. I don't know how smart this water is. It literally <laughs> pays taxes. Oh, no, 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 no. But yeah. <laughs> <laughs> gotta stay hydrated. It's hot. It's very hot, guys. But yeah, yet another vlog, and I want to react to True Geordie's response to Logan Paul. Um, and yeah, it kind of, again, puts things in perspective a bit. Like PewDiePie did in the last vlog, like I explained a little bit. I want to explain more of that. In well, I'm going to react to it kind of and talk about True Geordie himself, who I've started watching since he's blown up since the fight, really. And he's known as the moderator. <laughs> well, not anymore. Um, as you will see in the clips from from his uh, video. But yeah, I want to get on with this. And react to it, like run you through it, kind of give you a bit of context. And remember to stay hydrated. Yeah guys, so anyway, before I get onto the True Geordie reaction video, um, Demi Lovato, I heard like a rumour that she died, but it's obviously fake, because no one else said that. Um, I hope it's not true, I hope it's not true. Um, I know she's really ill, she's, she overdosed on uh, heroin. Not not a good issue to, to really start the vlog, is it? But I don't know, you get all that fake news, Facebook, it's always fake, isn't it? Well, until it's real. But yeah, I'm just gonna get up this video on my phone. And I do realise from the last time I did this, when I'm looking down at my phone, it looks like I'm asleep. But I'm not. Trust me. So yeah, True Geordie. Um, he is. He's a new YouTuber, in my eyes anyway. From what I've seen and what he's said. But he's come a long way in a short time. So let me find the video. Oh, a message. Of course, the video he sent out, he put out before this, was a bit more angry and aimed at Logan in that kind of way. But then this one shows a different side to Logan that we might not know. So, Logan Paul rang me. Things I never thought I'd say on a video. Ding, 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 ding. Top answer. Hooray. <laughs> fucking hell. Weird. Life is so fucking weird. The last week has been the most mental week of my YouTube life. Hands fucking down. So after last week's response to Logan Paul, you lot, you went mental. Uh, the support was unfucking believable I've never known anything like, I didn't even think people gave a fuck. And as someone who... I'm not going to get emotional on this video, right? There's just, there's too much to be happy for. As someone who loves what he does, to know people appreciate what's mental week of my YouTube life. Yeah, sorry about swearing before we carry on, guys. Uh, there is always swearing with True Geordie. True Geordie, what a legend. I didn't even think people gave a fuck in this. So basically, people put out petitions to get him to still commentate on the fight between Logan and KSI. Um, and he, he will be. But um, what Logan said in his other reaction video kind of almost got him fired. So yeah, there's a bit of that going on. And yeah, I'll skip to the bit about Logan. 
pocket just in case. Everyone texted me who knew me when you have to record this, you don't know what he's capable of. But to be fair, when he got on the phone, it was quite a long chat actually. It's unfortunate that that's how we have to get information across to each other. That's why I, I just wanted to call you and let you know okay. where I was coming from and how I feel. Now in the past when Logan's done something wrong, I've slammed him and done it fucking publicly. And I think it's only fair that when he does something right, I give him the same treatment. And to me, he did something right, yeah. He might yeah, so you find him up, and he's explaining like what they talked about, kind of in general, and he, he's giving this his new view on Logan Paul after having that. Not me, I'm a grown ass man, and maybe this is the version of Logan that people around him say. And if it is, then he seemed like a pretty decent dude, genuinely. It left me feeling more hopeful that if this guy's going to lead YouTube in future, that we've got someone who can turn it around. Is a bright lad, but has been very immature and got swept away and craving the content and the show and just getting the success w w without really thinking about what am I doing here and I'm hopeful that he is learning from his mistakes and the way he approached me impressed us. So as far as I'm concerned, it's squashed, that's it, it's over and done with. But it's been very immature and got swept away and... Yeah, he's not forgetting what, what has gone on in the past, but he's not forgiving him, but why should he? In a way, he's just admitting that he's a normal guy you know, and he goes on to say how many people at that age with that much fame suddenly don't make mistakes as if he wouldn't do the same and then he's going to show a bit about how he got to where he is today on YouTube and I'm going to thank them all got a podcast coming up which is the million subscriber podcast and I'm sure that that will be entertaining for you lot because I'm going to be fucking drunk but if you've only just joined the channel and you haven't seen the journey don't worry I've got something for you because it's been one hell of a ride Right, a message to Nile Ranger here yeah. Newcastle have been nothing short of absolutely fucking shit some of it is a bit sweary, but apologies, let's roll on. It is a big event. But it's, it's, for YouTube it's big, not for boxing. This season. What's going on everyone? It's the true Jordy back again with the Newcastle Southampton review. I don't give a fuck. I just want to win a trophy, mate. I want to win the Premier League one day. I want an FA Cup win one day. I don't think there'll ever be an after YouTube for me. I think I'll always do YouTube as long as you lot are here supporting us and want to watch us. If I get opportunities to do other things as well as YouTube, you know, down the road, maybe podcasting. Welcome to the True Geordie podcast. Bringing families podcast, together, yeah? the True Geordie. As I go. normally divide them, but you know. <laughs> <laughs> I've spent the whole summer with you guys. Every podcast that's come out, I've watched beginning to end. I'm a huge fan. How do you deal with losing such a good friend? Yeah, it was very difficult because I was with him the day before he did it mm -hmm. and everything seemed fine. I'd gone from extremely hurt to so angry with him and it was just because I see his two boys and just fucking do it how you want to do it like put your fucking makeup on get dressed meditate fucking put your videos out laugh if you can do a world record deadlift you can be the best in the world and there you have it guys but do remember that it's all YouTube. So, this boxing match, as hyped up as it's getting, I don't know. But yeah, it's another YouTuber I'm following now. Um, he's good at what he does. I'm glad I found him. Another inspirational story about YouTube and how far another, another legend has come. Good background in uh, in that kind of industry, but his his, his uh, career before that was uh, diving, and it was a normal career. Got paid, and like you saw, he mentioned it wasn't easy on YouTube. It was short for cash and everything, as a lot of YouTubers find when they're out on their own. I, I'm lucky to be of a family that's supporting me in that sense. So yeah, but yeah. Anyway, in in regards to Logan Paul, 
and the whole situation. Yeah, that's not the last video. And there's so many videos that YouTubers are making and making money off this whole situation, like reaction videos, and well, me as well, me included. But yeah, we'll, we will see. So yeah, True Geordie, subscribe to his channel if you're into that sort of thing. Check out his videos. I haven't checked out many of them from the past, but I will do. I will do. And I'll be talking about that more. So yeah, stay tuned. Stay hydrated. Drink your smart water or whatever water you want to drink. Actually, I don't recommend smart water because it's not smarter than any other water. <laughs> and it doesn't pay your taxes or do anything or do your washing or whatever. But yeah, enough about water and Logan Paul and True Geordie. Take it easy, fam. Peace. I'm out of here guys, ciao. Bike live, bike live. I know, right? You can hear me going for a mile away. Back from Europe. Boys are back from Europe. This guy uses sick music on his vlogs. I have some of this, like similar taste in some some of the music I use in the vlog. Austin Argy right here. Another day in the life of him cruising around New York. I so want to move to New York or visit New York at least or something. Spend time there for sure. Not as a tourist, like literally know what it's like to live there. Never been. It is always the first time. But yeah, through Casey's vlogs you always see, you always see that the, uh, the everyday side of New York. <laughs>